should be a piece of cake. All I gotta do is talk to his mother and find out what happened to him and who napped him. Are, are you Miss Cratchit? Yes. Yes. The mother of the kid who was snatched? Yes. I've got to ask you a few questions. Okay. You don't talk much, do you? Do you have any idea what happened to your kid? No. Look, lady, if you're going to find out what happened to your kid, you're going to have to be a little bit more talkative. <clears throat> okay. Now, <clears throat> I need your help. I don't know anything. She was as useless as a screen door in a submarine. <laughs> Look, lady, I need your help. Okay. Was your kid involved in anything shady? Yeah. He used to deliver messages for this old man, Wolfgang, at a restaurant. <gasps> Wolfgang, eh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sounds suspicious to me. Mm -hmm. Give him the name of the place, I'll check it out. Oh, Hitler's Haven. <laughs> Christmas. A time for suckers and con artists. I headed down the street. The place was on a corner with a dame outside that could make you... Make your knees weak and your teeth chatter. <laughs> Any chance of having a confab with your boss? Hey there, handsome. Follow me. Walk this way. Thanks, doll, but I'm uh, here on business. I followed, but only she could walk that way. <laughs> <laughs> Make yourself comfortable. My boss will be right with you. I'd like to, doll, but I'd rather have a gander down these stairs. Suit yourself, Buster. <laughs> Hello? 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 <laughs> Tiny Tim? Are you here? Here, here, here. There was no answer. No answer. No answer. <laughs> Welcome to my underground lair. <laughs> now you look familiar. Oh, really? I don't think we've met. <laughs> Sam Spade, Private Eye. Friday to date? Yes, I love your show. Thank you very much. And you are? I am Hossin Fretter, Austin Otto von this Wolfgang Wolfgang Dessert. But you can call me Wolfgang. Well, Wolfgang, I met your mom upstairs. She told me to come down. She's quite the looker. Yeah, Fräulein's got some great gams. <laughs> yeah. To get a chance to get my mitts on those stems. Forget it, Spade! Shucks! Who is this guy? What's a frowling? And who is this Schultz? Oh, uh, Schultz! <laughs> Why don't you go over there and warm yourself by the fire while my associate and I make Germany great again? Take your time, Doc. When the pure says we is the master race, but we hail, hail, but in the pure says no to love. So pure is the greatest race, so we hail, hail, but in the pure says, when the pure says, we've got to have our shells, and we hail, hail. <laughs> and if one little shell should blow him right to <laughs> then we hail, hail, and wouldn't that be slain? Medicine for my cold and aching bones. 
Do you two have anything to do with the tiny tin caper? Oh, he's such a numbskull with that spirit. <laughs> do you have your gunshots? Is Hitler or not? <laughs> oh, you think you're so smart, Mr. Gumshoe? How about one of these? And one of these? And how about one of these, Mr. Yankee Doodle Dick? Give it to him, shot! If you don't start talking, I'm gonna break my finger! I'm not gonna break more than that! I'll break your whole bloody arm! Now, what have you done with, with the kid? Who's the demon? What's in the secret room? What secret room? Don't play me for a Patsy Schultz. I saw you lie in that secret room ever since I stumbled down the stairs. I know nothing. <laughs> Oh, you would think that people show you our secret room. Schultz, hide the secret room. Yeah. Unlock the door. <laughs> I know nothing. I see nothing. You unlock the door or I use your boss's head as an ashtray. Oh, never will you mean this for you, allied scum. <laughs> no, no. Give me your gun, Spade. I'll take from here. Give me my boy. That's not the foul deformity. What did you call me? I'm not the foul deformity. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You heard me, Prince. You heard me. Even though large tracks have fallen into the grip of the Nazis, we shall not flag or fail. We shall go on to the end. We shall fight on the seas and in the oceans. We shall fight on the beaches, we shall fight in the fields, and in the streets, we shall fight in the hills, and we shall never, never, never surrender. Thank you, thank you. Help! <laughs> Spirit! Uh, unlock the door, I'll grab the kid. <laughs> Tiny Tim! I've saved you! You might have won this time, but I'll get you next time, Spirit! Next time you need. Draw nearer to me, all of you. Touch the cloak, Tiny Tim, and we'll take you home. Oh, I will get you for me, Spirit! You two screw! Oh. Tim observed, 
God bless us, everyone. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her King. Let every heart prepare Him room. And heaven and nature sing, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven and heaven and nature sing. Well, folks, I hope you've enjoyed your the Broadcasting Corporation of Newfoundland's first annual production of Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol. This program is dedicated to the 20,000 American and British troops stationed here in Newfoundland. Keep up the good work, boys.